Alright, hello YouTube, today we're back from another Minecraft Let's Play, Episode 2. So today, I'm just going to be showing you what I've done off camera, because I've actually done quite a bit. Well, really, all I found is a mineshaft, and in that mineshaft, I got a lot more ores, and I've got melon seeds, and also, I went and I got some more jungle wood to get some more cocoa beans, and there's another melon and pumpkin going right to block my path. Great. So I'll just break these. Break one of them at least, get out of the way. Alright, now I get upstairs. But the newest thing I've done here is I've updated to the newest snapshot, so I can actually make item frames now. And I want to see if I can put this clock on the wall and have it in the item frame and still work. Because that way you can put clocks on walls, it should be really cool. So I've already got my clock here, just going to make sure I have the supplies I need. Okay, I think I do. I think I'm going to have to make enough sticks. Oh, I'll probably have some sticks in this chest. I got one. That's good. Good start. Alright, so get some more sticks. And gonna get some more here. Okay, there we go. Alright, there we go. Okay, one item frame. Hope this works here. I think it looked nice straight about. Okay, we'll do it there. And you take your item and you right click in the frame and it should go in. And I think I'm not too sure if it's actually working right now. It's the same as what it looked like in my hand, but I haven't, it's not going to, I'm not sure if it's going to move. So we'll have to keep, oh, it, it moved. Perfect. We can have clocks on walls now, which is awesome. So I'm just going to leave that there. But now I think I might go check out my tree farm, which I've got all the different uh, saplings when I went across to find the jungle biome. So I've got all the different saplings here, so I can do a lot more designer houses and stuff, which I've actually been working in creative mode, so I want to build this new house, so I did get all these different saplings to do so, but I'm not going to chop them down quite yet. <laughs> when I actually was in the mine shaft that I found, I died, so I've lost all of my armor and my fortune pickaxe, which really sucks, but I had got to maximum enchantment, and luckily I didn't bring the pickaxe I enchanted, and it's right here, unbreaking and efficiency. Not the best, but it's still good. I've got my fortune iron axe still. I've I've got good stuff. But I don't have any armor. So I wanna get the maximum enchantment here. I also want to do more to the snapshot, so I'm thinking about going down and killing some zombies to go do that. And I'm, I'm looking up here because I can definitely make more armor with all the stuff I have here. But I'm not going to quite yet. Um I think I want to go kill some zombies in my zombie XP farm. Just so I can try to get carrots and potatoes, which is also part of the update, so I can expand my farm again, buy some carrots and potatoes, because they do really good, and apparently they can make some new potions, but they're only, you can only get them from killing zombies, and it's a really rare drop, so this might be a little hard to do, but we'll try it out anyways. I'm sure not think I have any arrows. I can shot them all here. Yeah. Well, I do have feathers, sticks, and flint. So I'll make a few more. Let's go. Oops. All right, twelve arrows doesn't do much, but works a trick. Should you put all my other stuff away? Yes. And I'm also gonna bring a piece of netherrack with me, and you'll see why. I think I might, I think I have a plan here to get items faster if the rare drops aren't dropping the way I want them to. So, I'll test it out. See if it works here. So yeah, whatever. So that should be the trick for the other way. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Alright, let's see. Alright, I'm gonna find the steel. There you go. Alright. Don't wait, gotta make sure it's on. Ha. Huh. There you go. Okay, so we'll go over to my zombie farm. Which I haven't been to in a really long time. I'm gonna go down here. Uh, it's a fair walk down, but 
definitely worth it. Gosh, I haven't been down here in a really long time. Yeah, here he goes, this one. I found it to this other cave, but I wrote down the coordinates and I actually got this, I made this path, because otherwise you'd have to walk really far around just to get into it, and I blocked the cave off, enjoy your spirit there. Oh, I forget how I get into it. Pretty sure I made a door. Alright. Oh, I need my buckets of water. Damn it. Oh, you're kidding me. Oh, whatever. I'm not sure I can have as many as I can right here. Maybe. Maybe I can get really lucky. Never know. Break down this torch. Some better light. More zombies. I don't know, I, I might go back, because I had I got stuck in my farm here, so I might go back and grab my equipment so I can fix up the farm. Oh crap, oh crap. So, I'll probably go back, <laughs> dead there. If I go back, I can grab the equipment I need, fix up the farm. No, no chance of dying when that happens. So yeah, I'm going to go do that right now. If I can get out of here. Oh no. Oops. Oops, oops, oops. Because ah. it doesn't really matter. No like, uh, zombies. Escape. Yeah, I didn't get anything from there, but watch. I'm just gonna shoot these guys. And watch if I kill them. And they drop carrots or something. As I shoot them from here. They probably will. Yeah, but it's going kind of successful. Could just keep the farm right here. Let's see what's going on for this. I want the XP. This isn't going to be easy. Break this at that time. Oh my god, mistake again. There we go. Okay, I'm gonna pause the video here. I'm gonna go run back upstairs. Alright, so I'm back here, and now I've got it all cleared up here, so we can now go in, we can get some zombies, and I gotta turn it back onto normal so that I'm peaceful because I would have got killed if I was rearranging those zombies. So, yeah, I've got this little staircase coming down back down here, so I can just take this staircase. And it should bring me into the room. I also have this spot right here. So if I walk in here, and if I were to dig up, like right anywhere in here, I'm right underneath the zombie spawner. So they should be spawning right above me. And then when they spawn, I can walk down this staircase. There you go. And uh, it should appear right here. And there's a torch I used, I broke it earlier. It should fall right into this. So it's just punch legs. But my plan is if I'm not getting it, the items, the potatoes and carrots, and punching them. I could just light this on fire and let them all die. I should speed up the process by a lot. I'm not sure. Are they coming? I'm not sure what's going on. you coming? I have no idea why they're not coming. Oh, is this part of the update or something? Oh, spiders don't work anymore. Did they get stuck somewhere? I don't think they can get stuck. Or can I jump in the hole? Oh, it just got clogged. That's all. Where did that go? Back out there. They're all trying to escape. That was adorable. They're trying to just 
okay, just go down. Oh, I... Oh, I see what I did. I jumped back in there. I see what I did. I didn't place the sign right there. Alrighty. Okay, so now, I should be able to do this. Oh, crap. Oops. Probably put dirt back there. Stop the flow of water here. So I'm not gonna have to do this road. Now I can hop down here. That's a normal password. There. Okay. Options. Normal. Back to game. And now, they will all fall in the hole. I thought I forgot to place the sign. I, I was placing them, I'm like, I swear I had two here. But, it just seemed to just be like, whatever. Probably were. So, <laughs> there's a little problem there. Yeah. Should get it now. I hear them falling. Here they are. I, don't, I can punch them, but it's gonna take a really long time. Oh, how did you get out? That's the flag. <laughs> Burn the items though. I never really thought about it. I'm not just gonna burn the items, that won't work. Hmm. This could take a really long time. Hopefully, I can get some potatoes in here. It's all this for potatoes. Kinda hard to believe. Spawn. Spawn. Come on. I can hear you. I can hear you. Come on, guys. Come on. Spawn down. I'm sorry for the sound lag there. You might have had some for after I fixed this place up. I forgot to turn off the sound going into the mic from the actual game, so it might be a little overlaid and slightly annoying and laggy. But it's just soft. Alright. Um, I'm not sure if I'm ever going to get anything here, so I think I might end this week's video, or this episode's video. I'm thinking I'll do this episode, like, weekly or something, but I think this might take a while. It said it's, like, the rarest drop they can possibly drop, so this might take a really long time. So I'm going to end the video here. Please rate, comment, subscribe, and hopefully, I'm going to keep on playing off screen, keep on doing this. Hopefully, I'll find some carrots and potatoes. And then for the next video, we can see and mess around with those and the new potions that you can brew with them. But anyways, for now, please rate, comment, subscribe, and come back for more.